Support for this program comes from campus groups. Campus groups. Campus groups. Groups. Campus groups make your events more complicated and glitchy. Campus groups. I use campus groups. You do? Not by choice, though. This is a global cell link prepaid call from. My name is Aswad the mother. And I teach corporate finance and valuation at the Stern School of Business. From the Stern School of Business at New York University, it's Serial, one story told week by week. I'm Sarah Koenig. For the last semester, I spent every working day trying to figure out where a business school professor was for about five hours after class one day in 2014. Or if you want to get technical about it, and apparently I do, where a business school professor was for four hours and 42 minutes one day in 2014. Every day this semester, I've tried to figure out the alibi of the guru evaluation. I want to point out something I never really thought about before I started working on this story. Time flies by in business school. It seemed like only yesterday I was passed out on the bullet train between Osaka and Tokyo. Japan trek, never forget. On November 17, 2014, I saw Professor Oz Watson-Motorin after the evaluation quiz Monday afternoon, only to hold my graded exam shortly thereafter. Only four hours and 42 minutes to determine that 37 students received an 8.5 to 9 on the quiz. The fact that he managed to successfully use his Mac Pirate Excel is a mystery in and of itself. I mean, you have to understand, like, no other professors grade that quickly. It's really hard for anyone to believe that you can actually grade that many quizzes that quickly. You know what I mean? So we decided to investigate this ourselves. We tried to set up a Demodoran-style stack of exams. At this rate, we would have to complete one exam every 1 minute 26 seconds without interruption for the entire 4-hour period. No luck. We talked to another professor in the finance department to see if this checks out in any way. Professor Charles Murphy, a clinical professor of finance at NYU Stern, offered this explanation. None of us can figure out how he does it. We all think it's actually physically impossible. So the only thing we can come up with is he actually has 12 children who took the course who have the exact same handwriting. We just needed to find Professor DeModeran and ask him. We have him on record from one of his classes. So if you have a question about this class, then the fair game principle applies. Those of you in my corporate finance class remember the fair game principle, right? Does somebody want to remind me what the fair game principle is? If you find me, I'm fair game. So the name of the game for me is for you to not find me. And definitely don't drop by my office after the sunset. I'm gone. I'm like a vampire. If I'm around here, I might change forms. Troubling. Troubling at best. Then we ask students about that day. Yeah, I think I saw him. He was wearing his yellow UCLA hoodie with the bear. The red vest. I definitely remember the red vest. And the black on black turtleneck ensemble. You know. I don't remember, but I do remember the Sosnoff ladies smiling at me that day. Inconsistencies. We just couldn't account for him. We tried to figure out his whereabouts. We plowed through his tweets, and somehow he was still replying. So I talked to my producer about this. So I'm having difficulty figuring out how he even got to his office to start grading, actually grade in time, and put the test in his so-called usual place. No one even saw him on the ninth floor of KMC. No cell tower data. Nope. No tweets? Well, it seems he told at Elder Trader that expected growth rate equals reinvestment rate times return on capital. Hmm. Seems normal. Sure. No blogs? Not then. He must have drafted an Uber valuation shortly thereafter that same day. What about step data? And aside, what we would have done was use the NYU Stern Play step data to confirm his movements. It was a spring 2015 initiative. In the meantime, we'll just have to settle knowing Robert Heller somehow walked 13,419 steps. Nope. No step data. It just couldn't be figured out. Or could it? And what about that Nisha call? Next time on Serial. <laughs>